Welcome back to the Force Nines YouTube channel and welcome to day number 8 of my Panini pack opening series. We're opening uh, FIFA World Cup stickers, 2 packs an episode, and which is one player from those 10 to represent us in our squad. Last episode, uh, the packs weren't very kind to us, uh, but we did end up with uh, Jesus Gallardo, the Mexican winger, in our squad. So uh, today, hopefully, they'll be a bit better. Uh, now, I did go out and buy some more packs, and I didn't have any of the tins when I went uh, to go buy them, so I just bought five packs, and uh, I do have the last one of the uh, first tin to open, so we'll open that first, and then we'll jump into one of the um, packs that I bought today. I bought five packs, so that'll last me for a couple more days, and then I'll go out and buy some more. I might just order a massive box from Argos, because I think they're a bit cheaper than the retail price at Argos. I think it's like $69.99 for 100 packs or something like that. So I could just go out and get that, and then after the series ends, I'll keep opening stickers as, as well. I want to try and get a fullback. I know we got Kimmich last time, but I didn't want to go for a second German. So uh, we're going to try and go for a fullback today. Uh, let's try and get an English player as well. Let's try and add some English uh, talent to the team, because, you know, I'm English. I want to try and get an English player. The only English players we've got so far are Eric Dyer and Ryan Bertrand, and that's it. I want to add to the England squad. Dio was in the book as one of our very first stickers, and uh, Bertram we have a duplicate of. So uh, I want to try and get some more English players. Uh, last time we got uh, Gallardo, we got Joshua Kimmich, and we got Jan Sommer as duplicates. So let's open pack one of two today, and let's see who is going to be joining these guys. Oh, what do you know? I've got an English player. So there you go, and it is Adam Lalana. So there we go, we've got ourselves an English player. He looks a bit different there. I mean, he's had a haircut recently, he hasn't got the Joe Allen locks, but yeah, uh, Adam Lallana. Um I don't like him on the game, though. Um, on Football Manager, I don't think he's very good, and I very rarely actually use him. I, I, I'm still, I still had him for Liverpool at the end of the save, but he just wasn't playing for me. And every time I tried to sell him, uh, the deal fell through. So uh, I, I don't want to pick Lallana. I don't think he's very good on Football Manager. Player number two in this pack is uh, Jesus Corona, who is a Mexican... Uh, what's red? Is that a oh no, orange? Is that a defender? Orange is a midfielder. Um, it's one we haven't got, so that's okay. Uh, oh, we've got uh, an Australian. It's a Premier League midfielder, Aaron Moy from uh, Huddersfield, who I think looks like the wrestler Martin Kirby. I don't know if you're aware of Martin Kirby. That's Aaron Moy, uh, and I'll put up a picture of Martin Kirby. That's not bad. Um, Aaron is a Premier League midfielder, and... What was he on loan from United or sold from United? I'm not quite sure. Uh, we've got a sweet uh, Emil Kraft from Bologna. I think he's a duplicate. Let me check. Uh, he is a duplicate. So there we go. Uh, and we have another duplicate. And for the second time in just a few days, we've got Ivan Rakitic again. So uh, we're going to go over about two days ago in that amazing uh, session where we've got Aguero and Griezmann and this guy, Ann Hummel. So we've got a second chance to get Ivan Rakitic. So there's one du well, two duplicates in there now. Uh, so let's open the first pack of the five that I bought today. And let's see who's going to be in this one. That was a clean open, man. Uh, so here, oh, that's a good player. And it's a Belgian. Do we have a Belgian for the team yet? Oh, we do. We've got Tielemans. So this would be our second Belgian. And it would be a nice uh, midfielder to pair Tielemans. It's Roger Nangolan. And then Golan, there we go. Um, very talented player, I like that. Uh, we have, oh wow, uh, Serbian from Lazio, Sergej Milinkovic Savic. He's decent, and he'd be our first Serb. Uh, we have the, uh, well, one of the many England captains, the Liverpool captain, Jordan Henderson. Two English players today, that's cool. Uh, from Senegal, we have Musa Wage, who plays for Cass Open in Belgium. Uh, let's try and get him to focus. There we go. And the last pack, last player, uh, from Egypt, playing for Al Ali. It's Saad Eldin Samir. There he is. So we've got some very good players in that pack. Um, Jordan Henderson would be good. He's English. Uh, let me just check if Wage is a duplicate. I'm not certain. Uh, no, he's not. He's a new player. So just Rakitic and Croft, the only duplicates there. That's not too bad. So, there I think we've got a choice of Rakitic, Henderson. Um, I've heard good things about Mil Milinkovic Savic. He's been, you know, attracting interest from Premier League teams. So, we'll have a look at him. Uh, 
and then nine golden i think so that was a pretty good um bunch of players let's have a look at these guys on the game and do you know what let's have a look at all the players you know we, we don't want to be missing out on all these uh guys that we had before so we're going to go through everyone so emil Kraft is a right back uh bologna 22 year old swedes so you know i said i wanted a full back and he is one so uh, do you know what? He's not a bad one either. He's 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 pretty decent. Lots of teams, which is pretty good. But I, I think of the players we got, you know, we got four very good midfielders. So I think we're going to get our midfielder to partner Telemans today. But we are just going to have a look at everybody else. So Aaron Moy is also a midfielder, and once again, he's pretty good actually. Fifteen first touch, sixteen passing and technique. Mentals are pretty good. Physically, it could be better, but Moy's not bad, you know. Uh, Jesus Corona, uh, primarily a left-sided player uh, from Porto. Uh, 17 dribbling's good, good first touch. Uh, 17 technique, good flair. Corona's not bad. Mr. Wygay's also a right back, not as good as Kraft, but uh, not bad again. Uh, Saad Samir, the Egyptian, is a centre-back who we get. He's a pretty good centre-back, actually. He's only valued at £300,000. But 16 marking, 15 mark... 16 heading, rather, sorry. 15 marking and 15 tackling. That's, he, he's all right. He's pretty good. Want to buy some Chinese players in the actual game. Uh, Adam Lalana. Um, I don't plan on using him, but let's have a, let's have a look at Lalana. I mean, the stats are good, but I've just never had much luck with him. So, I'm sorry, uh, Adam, but it's not going to be you. So, that leaves us with... Where's Lilana? I thought I'd lost Lilana for a second there. So, that leaves us with four. We've looked at Rakitic already. So, uh, Roger Nainggolan then. I think he's a very different sort of midfielder to uh, our fellow Belgian Tielemans. He's a Mazzala or box-to-box -box midfielder, very much like Henderson. I do like the sound of a Henderson Tielemans midfield though. That just has a really nice ring to it. Uh, but Nangolin is very, very good. I mean, him and Henderson, probably the best box-to-box -box midfielders in the game. So it's between those two. And considering we've already got a Belgian, I think I'm going to go with Henderson. And I'm a Liverpool fan as well. I can't turn down the choice to pick Henderson. Let's have a look at uh, Milinkovic Savic though, because uh, I've heard good things about him. I've never used him. Uh, and he's a very similar player as well. So we've got three players that can play as that box-to-box -box midfielder. Uh, Mil Milinkovic Savic has got a fantastic future, but at the moment he's not quite to the level of Nangolan and Henderson. So I think we're going to go with Jordan Henderson today, uh, and that is going to be player number eight of the team. And he's going to, well, for the for the meantime, partner Yuri Tielemans, and that sounds like a very good midfield. A Henderson Tielemans midfield sounds pretty good. I mean Tielemans, I don't know what he's like like creatively. I feel like we might need. Um, some sort of cam player to sort of really link the midfield and the strikers. Um, he's an advanced playmaker though, so you know, he could be good. But if we can upgrade on him, we'll try. If we get someone like maybe Modric or um, maybe maybe another chance to get Rakitic, I don't know. Uh, we could we could try and upgrade Telemans, but we'll see what happens with the packs. We've still got some positions we need to fill. Four backs, we still haven't done it. I was going to do it today, but the ones we, did, we got weren't bad. It's just the midfielders we've got were better. So Jordan Henderson joins the club, and uh, he is our first English player, and he's a Liverpool player as well. Is, is he our first Liverpool player? Yeah, he is. Yeah, I've got another one. So uh, Henderson joins the club. I get those in the book. Uh, I think we just got two swaps today. Um, it was Rakitic and uh, and Kraft, the Swede. So uh, that's a successful pack open, I think. Just a couple of swaps. Adds to our tin of, um, of duplicates. Let's see how many we have now. We do have exactly 20 swaps, and we've opened how many stickers now? Well, 105 stickers, plus the six that are in the book. So that's 111 stickers, 20 swaps. So that's, well, almost one in six is a swap, which I don't think is too bad. Uh, but tomorrow, we are going to try and do that fallback thing and try and get a fallback. I mean, if we do struggle, we might have to go for um, a three at the back if we really struggle to get fallbacks. But I'm hoping that we start getting some badges or squads because we haven't got one for a couple of episodes. So uh, if we do that, then we have no limit to who we could pick. We could pick a fullback for any nation if we get a badge or um, or a squad photo. So uh, 
that would be what I hope for next time around, so we can actually use one of those. I was a bit worried about using them early, but we haven't had one for a couple of days, so that's quite interesting. But anyway, that's going to do it for today. If you've enjoyed the video, make sure you drop a like down below, leave comments, and if you want to see videos as I'm going to turn up on YouTube, do hit that subscribe button. Henderson has joined the club. Uh, join me tomorrow to see who is going to be next to join my squad. And, uh, well, I still haven't decided what I want to do with it. I'm still trying to work out the whole World Cup thing, and I don't think it's possible. So what do you think I should do with it? Do you think I should try and add it to the Premier League or another season in Europe or try and put them into, like, a custom world super league database that i could try and find i know I'm, I'm leaving the floor open to you to see what you think because i don't know what i want to do with it i went into this thinking you know what no one has opened panini stickers and used those players in football manager i've never seen it done before i was doing it for a laugh and i actually had a look to see if anyone had done it and no one's done it people have done like ultimate team pack sort of things in um, Football Manager. I think it was Jen Calder or someone did it. But I see, I've never seen this done before. So, you know, as far as I'm concerned, I found a niche. It's not, I just, I don't know if it'll be successful or not, but I'm doing something no one's done. So I, I'm happy about that. Anyway, that's going to do it for today's video. I will see you tomorrow. Goodbye. <laughs>